Hello guys, this is Krynus here and today we're taking a look at how to set up Minecraft Forge 1.16.5. First we want to go to Forge Files, download the newest MDK that is available. That is the one on the left side, the one with the little bug uh, indicating that it's quote unquote experimental. We want to skip the dialog, open up the downloads here, create a new folder on your desktop and call it whatever you want your uh, folder to be called, it is recognizable. After that, drag in the MDK, create a new folder in there. That is now your project name. Put the MDK into it and unzip it in there. And for the files, we're already done with the setup. Now go to your IntelliJ IDE, click on File, click on Open. And now you're going to search for the newly created folder. It can take a few seconds for it to recognize it. That's why I'm looking around here a bit awkwardly. Um, once you found it, it will be in this um, little box and also has a executable symbol next to it. And you want to open it in a new window. And now the indexing starts for the project. Um, you just have to wait for this to complete. This is just a very, very tiny step here. And after that, you will need to run a command. And we are almost done with the whole thing. So let's just wait for this to complete so you can get an idea of how long it should take if you're sitting here after an hour of this happening then you did something terribly wrong or your computer is literally a potato And after it got built, we want to type in gradlu gen IntelliJ runs. This will create the run executable that we will use to actually launch the game in. Now you want to click on Add Configuration, click the application, make sure it's Forge 1.8, make sure it's saying Main. We want to apply that, click OK, and now we can hit the little green arrow and everything should be going up. So the Minecraft will now launch itself, I guess, with everything your mod contains. Uh, we have nothing in it, so it just launch basically a default version of the Minecraft uh, 1.16.5 with Forge installed and you are ready to mod the game. Let's just wait for this to also to complete so you also get a sense of how long it should take, how long it can take and well that's basically the whole setup done. It's not that difficult, pretty much IntelliJ handles all the stuff for you, don't need to worry about much. And we are in. Thanks for watching, guys, and see you in the next one.